Welcome to Proofpoint's how-to video tutorial series, which is aimed at sharing best practices for configuring the Proofpoint protection servers, features, and functionalities. This video tutorial is based on PPS version 8.6 and demonstrates how to configure DNS BL and RBL to aid in spam protection within the Proofpoint protection server, or PPS. Domain Name Server Block List, or DNSBL servers, maintain lists of IP addresses that continuously send spam. Organizations can subscribe to these lists so that they can block mail originating from the IP addresses on the DNS block lists. If your organization subscribes to one or more DNS block lists, you can configure the Proofpoint Protection Server to look up the IP addresses in the lists to help curtail the flow of spam attempting to enter your organization's email infrastructure. The DNSBL domains added to the DNS block list only control the lookup. They do not block the mail originating from the IP addresses on the DNS block lists. The DNS block list feature also allows you to select safe routes or IP addresses that will not be looked up or blocked by the DNS block lists. The Proofpoint Protection Server provides default policy routes that can be used to direct and control email traffic. You'll need to add your own internal networks to the internal net policy route so that email originating from your network is not blocked if any of your network's IP addresses are listed on one of the DNS block lists. Before adding additional DNSBL domains to the DNS block list, add your internal networks to the internal net policy route on the policy routes page. To add a safe route to the DNS block list, navigate to the system tab, DNS block list dropdown, safe routes page. Select one or more safe policy routes in the available list to move to the disable for any of list. The internal net policy route is provided by default, which you should update with your own internal network information before configuring the DNSBL domain. Next, click the Save Changes button. When adding a DNSBL domain, it's configured to check for text records, which the majority of DNSBL servers support. To add a DNSBL domain to the Proofpoint Protection Server, navigate to the System tab, DNS block list dropdown and DNS block list page to add the domains you want to block. Begin by clicking the Add button. In the DNS block list pop up window, enter information or make selections for the following parameters. Click the Test button to verify the domain name is a valid one. Click the Add and New button if you want to save the current DNSBL domain and add another or click the Add Entry button if you're finished adding DNSBL domains. Lastly, click the Close button. Thank you for watching our brief how-to video tutorial on how to configure DNSBL and RBL to aid in spam protection within the Proofpoint Protection Server, or PPS. For additional information on our products, visit our knowledge base at https colon forward slash forward slash proofpointcommunities.force.com. For questions, comments, or feedback on this tutorial, please email us at training at proofpoint.com.